Hello and welcome to another video on the scripting tutorial channel. Uh, today we will be learning how to create a custom kill streak script. Basically what this will do, it will broadcast in chat how many kills somebody has uh, and it will reset when they die. Uh, we're going to be using metadata in this tutorial simply because it resets when the player dies and it's just easy to use and it saves us from having to deal with that ourselves. So obviously we're going to be using the on death event uh, simply because this triggers whenever somebody kills somebody or when somebody dies. And then we need to make sure that the victim is a player and attacker is a player. So this means it will only happen when a player kills another player. And because whenever somebody dies, their kill streak resets, uh, we need to delete the metadata. We need to delete that. Delete metadata kill streaks of, of victim because that's who's just died. And then we want to set a local variable, uh, which means it will be deleted after the event is run. Uh, current kill streak uh, to meta I can never spell metadata metadata kill streaks of attacker attacker we're also going to add this little thing uh, question mark zero basically means if this isn't set so if they don't have a kill streak it will default to zero and then we want to add one to their current kill streak and then we want to set their metadata their kill streak to the variable that we have just added. I could, well, I could probably do that all in one line. Well, I could, but it's just better to simplify it out for you. And then if we want to broadcast it in chat, we can do broadcast uh, attacker uh, has just reached a kill streak of, and then we can use that variable. Uh, so that is it for this. So that is it for this tutorial. If you find it useful, please leave a like and subscribe. Thank you.